Hey, what is going on guys? Jay here from Maji and Jay. Today we're going to be unboxing and reviewing a very cool power bank slash jump starter that I got directly from Amazon via the Prime service. Now the cool part about this unit is that, well, I have seen a feature that not every power bank slash jump starter, keep in mind that the jump starter side is really important because we have power banks that already support the wireless charging, but I've never seen a jump start or starter that actually has that ability and that's exactly what we've got with this particular product now when i tell you guys the price you won't believe it this is only about 28 us dollars and at first i thought it was a gimmick i thought it was just going to be a really garbage product and no guys i went ahead and tested it and i'm super super impressed with the quality so first of all let's go ahead and get this thing open here and check the contents inside i do apologize for the noise that you guys are hearing on the background it's because we have landscapers around here but anyways, here we have the product itself. You can see the branding right there, push it on. And compared here to my Galaxy S9 Plus, you can see that it makes it look tiny. It is about twice as thick, and the width is about the same as my Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus. So on top here, or the bottom, if you wanna call it that way, we got the wireless charging capabilities. We have the power key. Now keep in mind that we also have a battery indicator and also in order for you to enable the charging on this particular unit, you have to turn it on. The lights must be on, otherwise it's not going to complete the charging. So there we can see that right now we are at 100%. On the front here, we got the USB port for charging purposes as well. We got the LED light and all we have to do to activate it is hold and press it for a few seconds and it turns on. And we have the strobes right here with different patterns. Okay, and then we got the micro USB port for charging purposes and the connector for the battery clamps. So inside of the box here, we have some other accessories, of course. We got, uh, it seems like a thank you card or something. Yes, it, this is like a thank you card right here. We have a wireless charging adapter for the iPhones. As you guys can appreciate right here, this is really, really awesome. And we got the manuals inside. Then we have here the USB cable. Now this one splits into two. We got the connection for the micro USB cable for Android. And then we have the one for the iPhone, the A-pin uh, lightning connector right here. So again, very cool that they have included this. And finally, we got the clamps so that we can jumpstart the vehicle in case you need to do so. So very cool. So there we have it for the accessories, guys. What I went ahead and did here with the 4Runner 2013 model, I depleted the battery on purpose just so that we can test this product and see if it works or not. So right now, after leaving the radio on for almost an hour, the battery died. I have no power whatsoever. So we're going to be connecting here this power bank and I'm going to be placing the camera inside of the engine bay. I'm going to re-attempt to start the vehicle while the camera is recording. That way you guys don't think that I'm providing a, you know, a biased review of this product or whatever you may call it. I want you guys to see that it works and that for $28, it is absolutely incredible. So without further ado, let's go to the engine bay and test this thing out. All right guys, so here we have the engine bay of the 4Runner. Right now, first of all, I wanna show you that the battery is completely depleted. Let me have Mayi attempt to start the vehicle. Mayi, go ahead and start the vehicle. And there we can see guys that it is completely dead. So now to get this thing jump started, first of all, you must make sure that your power bank is completely charged as mine is right now. And make sure that you have these available, of course. Without them, you cannot jumpstart your vehicle. That's kind of common sense. So then have them plugged in here, okay, to the connector. And then you're gonna get this uh, blinking light. Now, in order for you to successfully jumpstart it, this must be solid green. So let's go ahead and connect here the positive and the negative. And once we have a solid connection, it'll turn solid green as you guys can see right there. So now I'm gonna go ahead here and press the power key, which is again important as well. And now let's go ahead and have Mayi start the vehicle. Mayi, go ahead. Voila guys, it works. So there we have the evidence that this is a fully functional product guys. So not only do we get a cool looking compact power bank here, but we also get the wireless charging capabilities. On top of that, we can jumpstart the vehicle, whatever vehicle you're using from a four cylinder all the way up to a eight cylinder up to 20 times. So a very impressive product for just $28. I think it's definitely a great buy. 
I can't speak for the durability of it, meaning that I can't tell you guys how long it's going to last you, but so far I have used it for about three weeks. And first I started using it as a power bank and it did charge my device at least once, as I explained before. Uh, but now this is the first time that I jumpstart my vehicle and after doing so, I still have a full charge right here. So again, a very impressive product guys. For $28, you really have nothing to lose. Plus this is via Amazon with the Prime service. So if you don't like the product and you want to return it, um, I think they pay your shipping label, so that way you can send it back for free. So you really have nothing to lose. $28 is not bad for this little guy right here. So with that being said, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys on my next one.